back in Brightwood. It's the Vagarian. The Vagarians have taken us over, huh? That's not good. Sir Galahad. Fortuitous timing, my friend. You catch me on the verge of traveling into Weaver's Fen to inquire about Umberto. Pennyfather was adamant that I'd find answers there. I'm making Alchemist's son to the south. Of course. With so many leads to follow, it's good we can split up. I will not dally in the Fen. I will gather what information I can and then rejoin you and the Alchemist. Are we going to do anything Until with the Bagarian army might here? be with you, friend. Okay, I guess, I guess not. I guess not. I guess not. I'm gonna go tell him about how everything's ready. Ooh! Did not expect to find this here. Hold on. Let me put on my mining gloves. There they are. Gathering's increased, right? Yeah. The same thing as gathering speed? Because that's not the dexterous one, is it? Let's, hold on. Let's play a little diddle. Oh, nope, not fishing. Play a little diddle for diddle. Oh, no, 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 people are coming, people are coming. Um. Oh, phew, they didn't come and take my gold. My precious, precious gold. All right. So, song selection, playable. How are you today? Perfect. Hey, with the mandolin, decidedly dexterous. Okay. Crap, 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 crap. Nice try. Stole one of them. You're not gonna steal the other. You're over encumbered too. Why'd you why'd you take my gold? In the middle of a song too. The marauder, wasn't he? Piece of shit. Okay. Right, we can go over. Aha! Aha! Alright, we're gonna go into bear territory at that point. Ooh, wait. Something to mine over there? Or has it already been mined? No, no. It's right there. Aha! Found you. Black crag. I think I still have my mining gloves on. Star metal I can't have yet. In fact, let me just double check how far I am from that. Oh, I'm still pretty far. I'll take down a bear, sure. Let me just remember to put the right gloves on. Shadow Hunter gloves. Alright. Oh, 
Aha! With no damage. Perfect. Now I say that's decidedly dexterous. Going the wrong way! That's right, he was up the hill. Ooh. Right. I think I remember these. Twist cap. That was not a twist cap. Twist cap. I got better at harvesting. All right, Wolcott. Well, Marvelous. Job's done. Rushing Vata. Devade sunlight glints through the trees. Yes. Yes, I can work with this. Well, what will you do now? <laughs> now that you've marked these locations in my map, I have to get my paints in order. But it wouldn't do to get all ready to start, only to be missing the correct shade of blue. Uh huh. There's something to be said about the energy in moving water. The way it draws your eye and catches it. The power that just leaps off the canvas and fills a room. The power? How dynamic it makes an image. How alive you feel when seeing it. How it moves even when still. Mm. I can already tell these waterfalls will be bestsellers. I'm going to need more locations. More waterfalls? Yes. There are so many located in Grey Vale. It is a painter's paradise. I could use your discerning eye to find more waterfalls for my painting. If you pay me more. There's one up here. Okay. Put that one. Uh, there's one down here. And there's one over here. Okay. Well, that'll be easy to get to. It's right there. But the other one, not so easy to get to. 100 meters. Or miles? Meters. Meters. Probably meters. Definitely meters. That's something I can... Oh, it's down there. I think I can make the landing in water. Whoa! That did not work. That still hurt. Oh. Ow. Try me not to try that again. Get those twist caps first. Harvesting gloves. No, those are the miners' gloves. Okay. Just have to go straight. And I'm hoping we're uphill, and so we'll just, you know, find a way down. Yeah, it's this one. 194 miles. Meters. 120 meters. What's that red light? It's like an anti-Azov shrine. I guess a corrupted Azov shrine? Oh, that's not good. I know you said you wanted to come here, but I don't think it's a good idea. I mean, it's a beautiful waterfall. Gloomy waterfall. You know, challenge yourself. Paint, like, some Stygian blue. And just make sure to, you know, not get caught. Or corrupted. Stone nearby? Do I want to get closer to this thing? Oh, but it's right there. Just have to get rid of this guy. Mortimer Manor. 
Interesting. There is a place beyond suffering, she said. Come with me down by the river. Okay. You guys got anything? Are you holding out on me? I'm here to treasure hunt. The experiment. The abandoned barn was dark when I killed the illumined leaders. When Amelia first arrived and saw their bodies, she did not cry out. But then she called a name in despair and rushed to the side of a young man. I spoke her name in the darkness, and she, as she turned, I saw something new in her eyes. Fear. She thrust a small knife into her throat, and she was gone. She'd broken through the recall restraints. What? What are they talking about? What experiment? What's going on here? And she says, two years later, we unearthed her coffin to confirm her fate. None lasts that long. Most turn in a year. Succumbing to the madness of being buried alive. I struggled with my own madness. Amelia visited my dreams as a lost, as a corrupted, as a spy. In the worst nightmare, she was my daughter. As the nails came out, I tore off the lid, empty. Had she escaped? Had she re been rescued? Turned into a vengeful spirit or something worse? I knew she would never forgive me, nor would I. Ten years have passed, and I know only the spare. Fear pushed me forward, but never lets me live. Oh. Well, that answers some of my questions I've had about burying, uh, burying people who never die. The madness which eventually just drive you lost. I don't know if this is a great price to pay for eternal life. Just saying. She was chained in the narrow wooden box when she woke. She screamed and cried, sobbed and begged. Father, it's me. You're Amelia. I promise I won't tell a soul about what I learned. Don't let me die in darkness. Don't you love me? I showed not a hint of emotion or so I thought until I felt hot tears rolling off my face. To hurry her demise, I told her that we had ended her lover and he was now one of the lost she howled lunging against her chains and i nailed the box shut the others bent to help but i shoved them aside and lowered her coffin to the Frigido grave a father's lonely burden i feel like there's some missing puzzle pieces but i gotta find out this is too interesting i gotta find out what happens you guys know what happened not like you tell me. Well, I'm surprised the cow survived that. It won't survive this. Neither will that wolf. Oh, I'm sorry. You're friendly, Balder. Lars is clearly not interested in you. Oh. Oh. Well, I'm sorry for I'm sorry for slashing you. God damn. I got I gotta find out what happens. Wait, did I read that one already? Probably. Yeah, I think that was the second one. Oh, there's one up there. Okay. The commander handed me an envelope. I tore through the wax seal and unfolded, unfurled a page. Amelia Smythe, my daughter. Perhaps expecting a response, he raised a hand and said, There is no mistake. Your relationship, while troublesome, also affords you the highest chance of success. We need your help on this mission, John. What? What's going on? I still don't understand. And I want to understand. Did 
there are two ways to eliminate someone permanently on Eternum. Kill them until they become lost, or confine them and let them despair, let the despair do the work. But please don't misunderstand, I wasn't simply going to torture my daughter, the truth alone would guide me. Still, it came as a surprise when I discovered Amelia was not a simple scribe. She performed a magical, performed a magical for a misguided group called a Illumin. Even worse, she had discovered our most guarded secret, the magic we used to fix the point of, of recall after death. What? Okay, I have to find the last- I have to find the last piece. And read them all in order. You need to understand what's going on. This is some important shit. This is some important shit! To think- to think it'd be in, like, the notes of someone... ...in this random... ...hobble I stumble across? Really? That's insane. The odds of that. Just gotta find the last missing piece. And piece the story together. Aw oh man, the syndicate would be proud. But that's only if I can find this piece. I think I've already been in there. Where haven't I looked? I'll try again. I think I've already been in here. Yeah. And in there. Wait, have I? Yeah, I have. Already got that one. Hmm. Be around here. They already put the easel down there, right? Yeah, we did. Ah, you turned around. I'm glad you did. Damn it. Where's the last piece? I won't let this happen with the beach series. I couldn't find the last one there, but I will find the last one here. This is important information. It's definitely not here. I've been here. Oh crap, oh crap! Whew. Relentless. Oh, sorry. Again. Oh crap, almost hit you again. Hey boy, any chance you've seen a... Uh, glowing piece of paper around here? I gone up here? Can I go up there? Hold on. Let me just... Damn it. How do I get up there? I don't think there was. Was there stairs inside? I don't remember seeing them. We've already been up here, chances are. I need to know, I need to know, I need to know, I need to know. Oh! Actually. I don't think I have been here. Come on, come on. I just want to find out. Yes! Okay, we could read them out in order. 
All right, entry one. What? Why can't it? Why can't I go to entry one? What's going on? Oh, there we go. Okay, entry one. The commander had me an envelope. I tore through the wet wax seal and unfurled the page. Emily Smythe, my daughter. She's been chosen for something or um, caught doing something. Perhaps expecting a response, he raised a hand and said, there is no mistake. Your relationship, while troublesome, also affords you the highest chance of success. We need your help on this mission, John. So the highest chance of success. So someone with familial ties. You want them to do something. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta find a, I gotta find a place to read this. How do I get there again? Documents. Uh. Tales of Everfall? No. Tales of. A turnum. Crap! I lost it. No! I forgot what- there's just so many topics to go through! Tales of the Soul Wind, the Vagarian Knights, Tales of Great Cleave, Tales of Monarchs, Bluff, Tales of Windsward? No. That was a Brightwood, there we go. I don't know why I didn't see that. The Experiment. Okay. So John and Amelia Smythe. John Smythe. There are two ways to eliminate someone permanently on a turn. Kill them until they become lost. Right? So you just repeatedly kill them. They'll come back, confine them, and let them despair do the work. But please do not misunderstand. I wasn't simply going to torture my daughter. The truth alone would guide me. This is day five. This is day one, right? There's no, this is a briefing. Day five. Still, it came as a surprise when I discovered Amelia was not a simple scribe, so she was doing stuff that has her father know about. She performed magical research for a misguided group called the Illumin. Okay, even worse, she had discovered our guarded secret. The magic we used to fix the point of recall after death. I don't know what that means, but... Well, I don't know what they mean by that. But, apparently, she discovered that secret that he was guarding with other people in the organization who someone is the commander of. The abandoned bar was dark when I killed the Illumin leaders. When Amelia first arrived and saw their bodies, she did not cry out. But then she called a name in despair and rushed to the side of a young man. I spoke her name in the darkness. As she turned, I saw something new in her eyes. Fear. Oh, okay. So, you had to kill the group that she was a part of. You cared more about the group than you did your daughter. Your daughter was probably in love with someone. Probably in love with that young man. And spoke her name, Fear. She thrust a small knife into her own throat and she was gone. She would broken through the recall restraints. What do you mean by the recall restraints? I drew her out. Oh, maybe she used... Whatever magic they have to remove the point of recall? So she would die then? I drew her out by letting her think I would end her lover's torment. What is? What do you mean you drew her out? It was day six. Why, she asked, never taking her eyes off the young man. I had filled his veins with slow, agonizing poison. Oh my god. I guess her better judgment, I tried to reason with her. We saved lives, Amelia. We removed those who caused terror. You caused terror, she cried. My heart sank. She was beyond reason or salvation. Well, sounds like you're beyond reason or salvation. What now, she asked. Give us your research and we will let you go, I said. And as she reached into her satchel, I struck her unconscious. Why? Okay, so she didn't... I don't understand. She, she didn't kill herself. She was bleeding? She was changed in the narrow wooden box when, I, when she woke. She screamed and cried, sobbed and begged. Father, it's me, Amelia, I promise. I won't tell a soul about what I learned. Don't let me die in the darkness. Don't you love me? I showed not a hint of emotion, or so I thought, until I felt hot tears roll off my face. The hurried her demise, I told her that we had ended her lover, and she was now one of the lost. And he was now one of the lost. She howled, lunging against her chains, and I nailed the box shut. 
The others bent to help, but I shoved them aside and lowered her coffin into the freshly dug grave, a father's lonely burden. She's still alive, so you're, you're okay with her, her becoming lost. Two years later, we unearthed her coffin to confirm her fate. Why? None last that long. Most turn in a year. I'll just see if they were lost. Succumbing to the madness of being buried alive, I struggled with my own madness. I merely visited my dreams as lost, as a corrupted, as a spy. In the worst nightmare, she was my daughter. As the nails came out, I tore off the lid. Empty. Had she escaped? Had she been rescued? Turned into a vengeful spirit or something worse? I knew she would never forgive me, nor would I. Ten years have passed and I now I know only despair. Fear pushes me forward but never lets me live. Holy crap. That's crazy. I need to find out more about these guys. Maybe Amelia's still alive out there. She apparently broke through the you know, recall restraints, whatever that means. This is important information. Who are these guys? This organization, whatever it is, if they're still around. And magic will be important. I was looking for some stone, but that, I think that was it. The scorched stone. Okay. That was a detour. We made a we made a hard detour. What are we going for again? Oh, right. No. What were we going for? I forgot why we came here. Huh. All right, well, that was that was intense. I say we recall for now. And head to here. Fast travel to the shrine. Wait, this is Citadel of Brighthood is under attack. Don't don't we control Brighthood? Oh, we do. What's Citadel of Brighthold? This. Okay. Well. I'm probably not good enough to help. But I've always wondered what it's like. So maybe I'll do it this time. That's right, I have a PvP flag enabled. I want people chasing after me outside of town. Okay. Okay. Let's make sure no one's coming after me. But that's what I would do. I would just follow someone out. Okay. Protection's timer has started. How far are we? That's that's a distance. Why don't I just why didn't I just fast travel? Ah. Uh. Okay, well I'm flat for PvP now. you guys hunting turkeys I'm gonna make it What is that? What the hell is that? Fury of the Spriggan. Definitely looks furious. I don't even know if I'm even going to be able to help once I get there.
of what I'm supposed to do to defend it. Oh. Oh, phew. I thought you were a different fashion. Here we go behind me. Alright, we're almost there. Okay, I shouldn't be making any sound. Said it's under attack. Wait, do we control it? I thought the Covenant controlled it. Yeah, it's controlled by the Covenant. Are those cannons? Rotating cat. What? Those are some serious defenses. How do I do that? How do I get inside? How the hell do I get inside? Some way. It's like or gate tier three. Oh, who are those guys? Oh, oh, there, there are faction, there's syndicate. Oh. Dragzog! 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 All right. So we're taking it over from the syndicate. Great. Perfect timing. So we just kind of, just kind of, kind of wait here. All right. I guess we'll wait. Okay, we did it. I'm gonna go explore this, you know, control point we just got. Is there anything in here? For us? 
No public access. Okay. I don't know what no public access means. Can I man this? <gasps> oh wow, I could. A turret, huh? Boiling oil vat? That's foul. Watch it just in case. Horn of Resilience. What does that do? It's like a buff. That was fun. Which, uh, fun way to wait. Where are we going again? I got distracted by the whole, uh, Citadel invasion. Right, we wanted to grab this eye for reflection. Right, yeah. What? This doesn't, this doesn't count? It's a str the stronghold doesn't count. That's foul. That is foul. I guess we have to do it ourselves. Is that the defense point? What's going on here? War camp gate. I won't kill you. You're part of us. Wow. Okay. Day I'll, I'll help fight in the war. Okay. I think we're on the right track, yeah. No, oh, corrupted. Oh, we should probably get rid of our camp. I don't want to build one here, I just wanted to get rid of it. Okay. Alright, almost there. I see the light. Aha! Alright, now we can head over to here. Oh crap, I saw PvP enabled. That's nah, fine, we're, we're right there. I wanna have to go back. Can I change it at the shrine? Let me hold on. Let me let me let me let me let me let me. Alright, I'm just Ah, phew. No, it's right there, but you know, you never know. Bulgarians. I'm gonna keep this in mind at some point. The corrupted are probably a bigger threat, but I don't, I don't trust them. I mean, they're looking for Mirden's magic. That shit is foul with corruption, from what I understand. Based on what Sir Galahad has said. 
Oh, we have to go all the way back up. Oh. It'd be better if we just went there. Oh. Let me just go to the shrine. There's also other things we could do. Uh, Suits of the Earth is down here. Oh, but let's 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 go back here. It takes zero time travel. Fast travel, not time travel. I don't know why I said that again. Now we can go find that dude who is wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. It's fine. I'll just go around. Yeah, that way. The artist, Master Walcott. Yeah, he gave me a die box. So if I open this, what happens? Oh, okay. Your subsidian die. See, I don't want to waste a die on clothes and then end up not wearing those clothes because I find better clothes. Something feels strange here. The whole island feels strange, but it feels stranger here versus, like, I don't know, a few steps before we got here. Where are we? This is called. I guess it's just open territory. There's no landmark around. Alright, he's up there, I think. Ah! All right, Walcott. I've done as you asked. I've completed the task. These are magnificent. Thank you for marking their locations on my map. I can only hope my waterfall paintings are able to compete with what is already out there. What do you mean? There's other waterfall paintings? Uh, I'm not the only landscape painter on Eternal. Painter Cole is already famous for her Bear in Meadow and Mountain Dawn paintings, which are popular in the settlements. Ah, I see. You have a rival. Hmm. Waterfalls are thrilling indeed, but I also like to paint more tranquil landscapes. There's nothing quite as soothing as staring at a placid lake. Don't you agree? It's almost magical. I mean, if it's a good fishing spot, yeah. There are some nice lakes around here. I've decided that my next collection of paintings will be of the local lakes. Something restful to the eye and calm to the soul. They are certain to be popular. Wait, what happened to waterfalls? I, I'll paint them too. I need to paint all of them in order to keep up with that overachiever cold. Please, find three inspiring lakes where you can place my easel. All right. That kind of sounds like a euphemism. Place his easel. I want to place my easel. I have a place where you can put your easel. 